Hello, I'm Grand Moff, and you're uh, here for episode 12 of my Romanian uh, Let's Play in Hearts of Iron 4. Uh, when we last left off, we had uh, conquered Turkey and had jumped down into Cairo and Egypt and uh, taken this before uh, Italy could, could steal it from the United Kingdom. Uh, plans for this episode. Uh, we're, we have uh, military access through Italy, so these six units are going to make their way down to this port and we're going to try and snag uh, South Africa from Italy. Hopefully they take a long time to get there. It's going to take us 50 days um, to, to get this all planned out and for us to make a landing. But I think um, you'll agree that it's probably worthwhile. We get a shit ton of chromium if we come down here. Just an absolute ton of it. I mean there's 200 there, or two, 220, uh, and then another 80 here, a little bit of uh, iron, and another 116, so there's just like almost 400 chromium down here to be snagged. Uh, will we get all of it? I, I doubt we'll get that, this part up here, but maybe we can snag these if we jump in real quick. Um, from there, uh, this little band of troops are going to come over here and try and snag this island from the UK. It's got a ton of rubber on it. It's going to help us uh, with planes and stuff like that. And then uh, I was thinking possibly maybe over to the Netherlands. You know, we are at war with them, as you can see, and they have only three divisions. So this is ripe for the taking uh, if we can get in here. Possible problems with this plan is that uh, we don't have navy supremacy so we could get got pretty easily uh, hopefully that will not be the case and uh, we'll be just fine but you never know uh, other things going on uh, we're about to push the button I might as well do it right now while I'm talking about it as we're gonna bump up um, to service by requirement one million available troops now uh, we were already recruiting some more reserves um, because we took this land down here and I wanted it to be uh, properly defended. Uh, and quite honestly, look at look what's going on. The UK has made landfall up in Germany. Uh, we have a non-aggression pact with Italy, so we cannot declare war on them. But we don't have one with Germany. And we also have a lot of divisions of the Soviet Union here. Uh, the problem is the, the Soviet Union still has a, a problem. They've done the Great Purge and they haven't gotten rid of it yet. So until they get rid of it, um, because they do have a hefty negative 50 division organization uh, penalty because of the Purge, uh, I don't think it's a great idea to go to war with Germany until they get rid of that. So they're doing anti-fascist. They're, they're already going to not like Germany. So they're going to want to jump in here. We're going to keep our main unit uh, on the border, on the south border with Italy and, and Germany. Uh, just in case, you know, the Soviet Union gets Prague and they jump, they, they see them weak. Uh, I think we want to fight them. We've held them off from expanding to Poland. Italy doesn't seem to have many forces up here. Uh, they really, it doesn't show them having any. So that means Germany has to defend on two fronts. They're going to have to defend over here, and then they also would have to defend all of this and, and the south of Italy. Uh, while Italy has a few troops running around down here, I'm not overly worried about them. So we're going to focus on trying to uh, continue to snake uh, territory away from them before they can get it, and then uh, see where we go. We are uh, fabricating uh, or, or justifying a war against Iraq uh, to get some, some oil and to possibly have a gateway into Iran and, and, a, and a land, uh, a way to walk to the British Ra instead of trying to make landfall uh, by boat, which would... Uh, potentially be disastrous. 
but you know we're gonna try we're gonna test out the waters with this maneuver we're only giving up six divisions let's uh, change this though and let's train some more mountain units because there's a lot of mountains and and you know this part of the British Ra and Iran has quite a few uh, there's lots of mountains in here in case we we do need to use uh, some of those units so I don't know I had five more uh, six and then we'll train some of our regu regular units uh, let's see 10 might be okay that's uh, 12,000 manpower each division these are significantly less and we have a ton of uh, experience points we might as well uh, make these better we can make them quite a bit better actually and well, why not give them a field hospital we don't have endless amounts of troops so it's gonna be good to try and keep them alive we're up to 8600 now uh, this this layout's already really good at least in my opinion we've got lots of soft attack lots of good defense not a great amount of heart attack uh, piercing's not awesome either but it's not too terrible they're short on support equipment and artillery pieces these guys are getting artillery pieces before them because they're uh, an elite unit excuse me so yeah once these guys are are done we want them to deploy and you guys are gonna deploy to them I think I did that right. Yes, maybe. Yeah, I think so. These mountain units, I think we'll have them join the main main force. I can go in there. Actually, they need to. I'll be Transylvanian units, don't they? Yes. Oh, let's make them North Transylvania since it's more mountainous. A little, a little bit of RP for us. There we go. And for the main units, I guess they can join, join him too. We might break some off and, and have him get some. This is a regular unit, so it'll just be in Transylvania. And this guy is gonna be beefy soon. He is a level five. He's got offensive doctrine and he's a logistics wizard, which is good uh, to put a lot of our uh, units in. This guy's level four and he's, he's a hill fighter. So maybe it would be better to have the mountain units uh, assigned to him. Okay, I think that's probably enough talking without action. Sorry, I've been talking quite a bit. I'm going to pause. And kind of keep our eye on this. we got quite a bit of time to wait until uh, our justification comes through. Okay, I reloaded the game, so apparently the Soviet Union said, we don't want to be here anymore. I'm guessing they're all going up to attack Finland. I, I really don't think you need that much, guys. There's like, <laughs> they have like 15 units. You got, you know, a couple hundred. Ooh. Well, maybe the Japan will take the Netherlands before we can get there. They are poning China's face right now. I kind of wanted to uh, to jump in and be able to uh, 
be able to attack the British Ra before Japan. Like, if Japan takes all this and the British Ra, I'll be very, very disappointed. Our units are making their way down here. No, go down. You know what? I don't want any of that stuff. What are you going to do now, huh? You go where I told you to go? To the evasion? Down here? Maybe? No? Okay. Why would you? Ah, uh, no! My little convoys! Jerks! What jerks? I'm trying to sink my convoy as well. I-49, all that. Uh, sinking some ships. <laughs> what is going on with this? Yeah, eight divisions. 14 transports. Uh, these guys have just gone full retard, it looks like. How about you guys go there and make a naval landing there? What the Jiminy Christmas? No divisions, no transports. Uh, sometimes this game. I'm sure I'm just messing up, but. What do we want the tanks? I have no idea, to be quite honest. I mean, surely they need to be Transylvanian, but. Not sure who to uh, apply them to just yet. Hmm. Okay. That's the one going. Maybe it's because. All right. Let's delete that. Go from there to there. And no divisions, no transports. go. Nope, not there. Are we ready for this? No, nope, 25 days. I'm not making great progress there. I have no idea what ha is happening with these dudes. Division belongs to an army but has no orders. What are you talking about? Join that. Well, I mean, what else have I been doing this whole time but that? I don't, I really don't know. What in the living fuck? Stop. <laughs> what the heck? You guys are... Just have to do this. I guess that works. Not exactly what I wanted, but okay. Where's
Browser Research. Do we want to do more industry? This would be nice. Another 20% production efficiency gap. Is there anything else we should be looking at right now? Mountaineers soft attack and organization would be nice. Field hospital. That would mean our trickle back would be 40%. Right? I still have a really long time to research that. Probably not that. Do we want to look at tanks? It's 1940. It's about to be 1941. I can start in on another tank. I really don't have many tank divisions. Uh, rocket artillery. Doing that. Doing destroyer. We still haven't researched this. How important is that? I'm not sure. 82 days for encryption. Yeah, we'll just go with another assembly line. The other one is about done. Concentrated industry is about done. It's at 42 days left. Once that's done, we'll probably jump. I don't know. Probably into light tank three. It's a possibility. And we're doing aviation effort, but uh, we're going to quickly switch over to uh, this diplomatic tree because somebody is influencing us to be fascist. I'm assuming that's Germany. We don't like that. So by going down that diplomatic tree, we can uh, reduce the, that. Special forces would be like a Marines and mountain units. We don't really have bombers. We don't really do this. So it's, I haven't done anything with that yet. Ground support might be really good. Maybe we want to take that. We're really gaining at a, a slow amount right now. Naval maneuvering might be really good. Maybe we want to do motorized. Could help with our research time. We only needed about another 23 days there. Uh, it looks like uh, Germany kicked them out, but now they're attacking in Denmark. Looks like, yeah, Denmark controls their capital again, Copenhagen. I have thought about invading Sweden. Uh, they have a ton of steel. Just a ton of it. I mean, look at this. There's a hundred there, another twenty, hundred twenty, uh, another eighty. It's two hundred. Lots of tungsten. We are at war with Norway already. They have aluminum and some steel. So I, I was thinking about maybe doing a, a landing there, but it's going to take a long time to fabricate a claim on them. And I'm guessing these guys have naval superiority right now, so it would be tough. We don't have 
lots of good ships, so. Planes doing their work there. Where do we get nine from? Oh yeah, I want to delete this. Because I don't think it's important. Japan hasn't really started in on them yet. They're making their way. We're about to hit the button on this. Looks like we need to send an air wing down there. So, looks like we have an airport here. But how, how big is this airport? Uh, well, let me... I have a... Uh, Gosh. Can I assign? Doesn't really look like it. Fighter 2. So maybe I can't. Maybe I can't push the button on this without Intel. Will it go? Please and thank you. This is such a bummer. Well, I'm making mistakes. Unfortunately. Yeah, I'm not getting that option when I click on this, so I don't think I could rebase there. But I wonder if I could make another one. All right, let's cancel that. <laughs> Do it from there to there. some fighters here. Well first let's oh, let me pause this. We'll get a hundred of these and we're gonna put them in there. Oh, yeah, bomb ships. And then we're gonna do another one with fighters. fighter can just deploy over the Middle East and that should give us Intel, right? Or does it need to be the Red Sea that we have Intel on? Not 100% sure there. 
I no longer want you a part of that. So go up there, please. Uh, yes, research. We're gonna go into this. Why not? What's our production looking like? Uh, we were doing fighter twos. Now we're doing our fighter ones. Now we're doing fighter twos. That much better. Light tank. Why are we still making light tanks? Did I really mess that up that bad? Okay then. How many light tanks do we have? Like a million? Quite a few. And they're like generation one light tanks. Okay. Do we have a lot of motorized units? We're short on anything first. We are short on motorized a little bit. A little bit. Not too terribly bad. We have a couple of those. So let's make the light take this too. Which does take more uh, steel up. Let's push this up some. Can't do mechanized yet, right? No, we haven't researched it yet. I don't think. Just thinking about how I want to fill out some of my lines. We do need more steel. Our good buddies will help us. We were repairing some military factories that were damaged. Where are these factories at? Are we getting bombed over here? This says we're not. Maybe they're just still broken from when we took them. All right, well, a couple failed invasions. Uh, we gotta be getting close to being able to go to war over here though. Yeah, fairly close. Looks like England still has a bit of a foothold over here. I'm really tempted to just go to war with them. like. The allies really are weak. They're super weak. Look at this. The Soviet Union has way more units. We just need to wait for the Soviet Union to be a little bit stronger. Let them uh, get rid of that purge uh, penalty. And maybe we'll just sweep in through sweep in through there. Take uh, all those resources. Could be super nice. Our army is uh, it's getting much larger, and it'll be even more so. I, I don't really care about how trained up the reserves are, so we can deploy all those. The rest of them, since we don't need them at the moment, we're going to let them uh, train up. I guess we'll let these tanks join join him. And I think that's gonna be it for this episode. Sorry it wasn't that action packed. I, I won't blame you if you uh if you wanna skip through some of this. There wasn't a whole lot going on. Uh, 
I, I misunderestimated, you know, this mechanic down here. I didn't fully understand it. It's my fault. Oh, it looks like... Oh, that's not good for them. It looks like they're possibly pushing back here a little bit. If they could push up, push up to here so I can get a corridor and come down and crush you, that'd be awesome. I have thought about attacking Republic in Spain. China is getting worked over here. But I'm not seeing the battles anymore. For whatever reason. Maybe they're just not attacking. China still holds uh, this part up here. It looks like I need to... to get an, an air base or something so I can get uh, visibility into here. Whoa, 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 whoa. Where did you come from? Did you, like, parachute in somehow? We're not at war with them, are we? Yeah, America's not in the war. So I wonder what's happening there. Okay, well, uh, I think I'm going to end it here. Oh, wow. It's a nice little bonus. I guess we can start researching bombers. Start looking at mechanized. Alright, I'm going to end the video like I've been saying for the last few minutes. Uh, hope you've enjoyed. Sorry, this one was a little duller. Hopefully the next one will be a little bit more action-packed. Thanks for watching. Talk to you later. Bye.